is that we've done. So if I take my Perth Kilt Run, for example, and I go to Candid Pictures, maybe I want one of these in my download. It doesn't matter. Um, let's pick a picture here from the Candids. Actually, let's go to Mass Start. That's what I was looking for. Let's say I want to buy a CD download, um, and I'm in this picture here. It works the same for any image that you're um, looking at, whether it's a download of a CD or maybe you just want to be included in a picture or maybe um, we've misindexed one of your images or the other way we've put someone's bib on your image. It all works the same. If you go to the screen where you can see the picture and all the prices, right under here it says report index error submit correction. If you go ahead and click on that, it gives you an option. So let's say I was bib number um, 611. I would do that. And I'll just put in my email address here. And I'll hit submit correction. What that does is that sends that correction to our staff, who will then go and update that. And if I've put my email address in like I did, then I'll get an email once that's complete. So let's say the unknown runner. Let's say I go and I find myself. Let's say I'm, I'm this guy here. Hmm. And uh, let's say I'm this guy and I'm bib number 125. So rather than being R, I would be 125. I'd put in my email address and hit corrects, uh, submit correction. And that's how you retag images to make sure that you're included. At the same time, let's say I'm bib number 125 and this shows up under my pictures and it's not me. I can go back and change that to an R for an unknown runner, or I can put, you know, not me or question marks, things like that, something so that our indexers know that's obviously not me. All right, thanks for uh, watching. See you next video.